Okay, folks, we're inside of a uh, Class A motorhome, 1999 Beaver. What I'm doing is taking some readings. It's 87.6 degrees at the ceiling. Why am I doing this? Well, I'm getting ready to coat the top. It's a all fiberglass roof. I'm going to coat the top and I'm going to put in a ceramic element powder that's supposed to reflect heat. So I'll record the temperature inside at various locations. Alright, so we're up front looking at 90.7. Alright. And 93.9 right by the windshield. Okay, so we did a couple locations. Now we're going to go toward the back. All right, here we go. We're going to do it right here by the refrigerator, by the vent fan. All right. 87.8. Okay, now we're in here where there's no proper ventilation at all. We're going to do this inside the bathroom. Here's the shower with the sun screaming. All right, we'll do it right here by the AC unit. The rear. So we got 88 degrees on the money. All right, now we're back here by the bedroom. All right, let's see. All right, here's the AC duct coming out. 87.8, so pretty close. Now we're gonna do all the way back by the end cap. It's a one piece fiberglass roof. Now after I eat, because it's my lunch time, I'm going to take readings on a roof at the same locations. This is inside. Then I'll do the ceiling job up top. Okay, if you want to know what it is, this is a, a master cool, like there's a part number, infrared thermometer. Good for checking various things, like what I'm doing now. Uh, evaporator temperatures, condenser temperatures, even circuit breaker and fuse temperatures. All right. Uh, thank you very much. This is Jeff from RV Diagnostics. Don't forget that I'll be up on top of the roof taking readings. And then that's the befores. Before inside, before outside. And then I'll do after, after I apply the coating with the ceramic powder inside of the paint or the coating material. And then I'll do again after inside and after outside. Thank you very much. Once again, this is Jeff from RV Diagnostics.